Hello, my name is Kelly. In this episode, let's discuss Internet of Behaviors. Why Gartner ranked Internet of Behaviors (IOB) as the top nine technology trends in 2021? IOB simply means using data to change human behaviors. The current data sources that can be collected include business customer data. Citizen data processed by government agencies and public departments, social media, public domain deployment of facial recognition, and location tracking. Based on the collected information, user behaviors can be influenced through feedback loops. Do you think data feedback can really affect user behavior? Take my auto insurance company TD Insurance as an example. TD Insurance has launched a mobile app called TD My Advantage. When driving, the system will automatically detect various indicators, including vehicle speed, mileage, time of day, rapid acceleration, hard braking, and hard turning. Every time you arrive at your destination, you can see the real-time feedback on the mobile app. When you renew the premium. The insurance company will provide standard premium discount based on the collected data, up to twenty-five percent. Indeed, after seeing real-time feedback, most drivers will pay attention to the indicator with low score next time when they drive and drive more carefully. But because it's an application, when you don't want the insurance company to detect your behavior, you can simply close it. So to get the discount. The insurance company requires that you must use the app for at least 120 days, and your app must record over 1,000 kilometers. This is the usage-based insurance (UBI) we have heard in recent years. The better you drive, the lower your insurance premium. Some insurance companies also provide other ways to monitor driver behaviors. For example, through a system. Built into the car, or through a device plugged into the OBD2 port of the automobile, or via devices called tags installed on the windshield or the rear window, and paired with the smartphone via Bluetooth. Remember, when you sign this type of UBI project, make sure to clarify the terms. For example. Will the insurance company increase your premium based on the data collected? If someone else drives your car, or when you are a passenger, does the monitor system has a means to distinguish the driving is not yours? Regarding data security considerations, imagine the insurance company knows where you are driving from and where you are driving to, and when you drive during the day. If this information is obtained by criminals. It is easy, for example, to plan a kidnapping case or other criminal activities. But IOB has become a technology trend and will significantly influence our behaviors and life. The author of Data Civilization, Tu Zipei, once calculated that using a camera to record a person's behavior for 24 hours will generate 4 gigabyte data in one day. And about 143 terabytes of data will be generated in 100 years, according to the current price of a hard disk. It only needs about 7,500 U.S. dollars to store the data generated during 100 years. Now we are still considering which data needs to be recorded, and perhaps in the near future, what we really concern is which data does not need to be recorded. What are your opinions and questions about Internet of Behavior? Thank you for your attention.